Jastone here and today we are going to be playing some revelations and this is going to be on the side of me uh, playing them um, custom zombie maps because um, revelations 2.0 is a completely different map so it will not tie into this in any way so this is just like a side like a shell in shuffle so uh, because I have not done gameplay of this yet so I thought to do something on it until we get a um, chronicles for black ops 3 as you can see i'm prestige for level 13 on the zombie version of black ops 3 on xbox one this is and if uh, that division no treyarch have actually uh, give us some zombie chronicles gobble guns from mega and give us one uh, one of the ones each um just to like i think give us a taste of it, uh, which is good and um, I haven't shown this before Newton's coop book where you can trade gobble, trade gobble gums for different things and three of them for one of them I don't think I want to do that actually might do that I'm not sure uh, I think you have to purchase them do you oh no I've got a faith of three I forgot to do them um, but yeah, as you can see there's some discount on it at the moment but don't really need them for now we've got daily challenge but we're going to get ahead and um, we're going to play some revelation so uh, let's get into it and uh, we're just going to uh, play some of this map and if you're wondering uh, what, what the easter egg is it's just the giant which doesn't really have an easter egg to it but let's get into the game Billy okay we're getting into the gameplay now and uh, we're just gonna get into this oh here we go we got this massive giant and uh, he's zooking the bag a bunch so uh, taking the pack a bunch so um, we're gonna have to get that some way so uh, let's get that later on. I know how to get it obviously but um, I'm going to get that later on, and I've got unquenchable, I forgot, uh, I don't know why I've got aftertaste, I haven't changed them, oh well, but we've got some gold gobble guns, we get a free one each round as well now, which is awesome, I'm not sure if they'll keep that forever, but I hope they do, so the first thing, after we got that gobble gun thing, see what we get, um, we can get an extra pick though, after we've got uh, nearly all of them, uh, well, f the maximum pick size, and then we can get another one. Uh, and that's without Percolic, because Percolic just gives you all of them. But we're going to get a um, quick five and uh, hopefully survive quite longly. I'm going to hope that we can keep this on for as long as possible, because I've still got a load of um, zombie maps to do for... Uh, the custom ones and uh, I'm going to try and run some side uh, sort of uh, I don't know gameplay th than that because uh, other than that because it's sort of boring if you don't have something like revelations in between because you want something else other than that so uh, yeah I'll try and do that at the moment uh, so then uh, we aren't stuck on nearly the same thing even though there is a new map of it every day we can uh, run some th side things so we're, we're going to do this corrupt thing where we open this portal to an act to run to it and, uh, basically where you can program stuff it, well it programs this panel which I'll show you later on what it does and hopefully this won't last for too long right there we go done so uh, we've done the first panel, we've got the, that, I think that's one or four, and we've got it in like Mab of the Dead and that, uh, where we've got activate different corruption uh, engines or whatever they're called. As you can see, this is the first one, and we've got activate them three, which is, I'm not sure what that one is, that, that one of them is Shang, I think that's Shang -la. Then you've got Mob of the Dead, I know that's Mob of the Dead, and I forgot over it and one of them's roots but I'm not sure if I can tell I can't even tell that's this one only by the church I guess but I'm not sure 
I nearly got down looking at that then, but I didn't. Right, let's replenish from house first ever go. Now, I'm not going down, right, okay. I'm gonna run in between these, and we survived. We're okay. Nearly got down, but I didn't, because I'm lucky. I haven't customised these yet because I haven't unlocked it, I don't think. And we can actually get the death machine on this one because we haven't got World of War weapons. I'm just going to get rid of it because it's ended around. But uh, we can actually get it on this one, which is good, so uh, it isn't custom. We'll have it, and it's on Xbox, so um, yeah. Uh, I've got it on Xbox, the DLCs, because I'd firstly get Black Ops 3 on Xbox because that's what I mainly play on. And I mostly just get old Call of Duty's on uh, Xbox, but I'm not sure about the next Call of Duty, whether I'm going on Xbox or PC because of the servers, really. Uh, the servers are really good on PC, so uh, that's why I mainly get on Xbox. But uh, for Black Ops 3, I got it both for Xbox and PC. I even got Black Ops 3 before it was confirmed that we would have Mad Tools, so I couldn't have the uh, Mad Tools and like. I could have got it for nothing, and uh, yeah, quite. A, but I basically knew they were going to bring some mod tools out, so that's basically why I got it. And I thought the sales would have gone up if it was confirmed, so that's mainly why I got it. So uh, yeah, for the custom zombie mats, because I do absolutely love the custom zombie mats and the mod tools that we've got because uh, we haven't had them since World of War and I've played a bit of World of War but I know it's a lot better with these graphics and everything that it's up to date and everything because Infinite Warfare I don't think is much different and isn't that good of a game so uh, yeah and plus the special rounds on this is these little lost type things I like to call them. so we've got insta-kill for now and we're gonna right, we'll go right now um, I'm going to try and kill these. We did have these on Shadows of Evil, I now remember. Um, but they were uh, yellow. So we uh, the red on this one. Like We've got a Magua, which is purple. But I'm not sure what the difference is. I think they're more powerful. I don't think these are more powerful, though. Uh, unless it's a story-related powerful. I don't think they're more powerful in the actual game. So, uh, yeah, I'm just going to go through here and uh, go to net and check out what I've got. So, if we go up here, I might as well open it. We've got this, which will trigger is to open that door. I'm going to the mouth of that monster, that neck, the pack punch, and then we can pack a bunch, which makes it pretty easy to pack a bunch on this map, really. So, we've got Jug now, and... Uh, if we go back through because we can't access otherwise, and I do like this teleporter, um, we can either go that way or this way. This way will take us to Origins, which I'm going to go this way because I quite like this way. And we've got the mystery. I didn't even look for that, and luckily it is this way. So we're, we're going to go through these doors, which opens this door and the one up there. If we look. Yeah, that's one. That one has opened with the with the other one. Uh, oh, we got the MP. That's awesome. I wasn't sure what I was going to get out of that. I hope I do get like thunder gun or something later on. At least the ray gun because I need the ray gun. Really, because that is quite a powerful weapon. Some people don't like it. I don't know why though. But it has been um, on zombies since it starts, so it basically makes it... Oh, we got the Rift D9, that's awesome. I do like this weapon. Not sure if it's too less of a powerful weapon, because it does take a while to recharge, I guess. Because it just does that, I don't know why. But I don't know why I've got Arms Grace as well, because I'm not going to get revived on this, am I? Well, I'm um, not going to die and then come back after a round because there's no extra players so I haven't checked that through but it doesn't really matter because uh, hopefully I won't be using many gobble guns because I'm trying to do this with quite less of a gobble gun type disaster so uh, 
We're getting up to one minute thirty, so uh, that's so. The I've got a. Uh, I've tracked it down how long it took for the cutscene because I had to cut that out of the video. So I'm just judging by that in what a sort of time I'm going to be ending, which is going to be 15 minutes for you guys, hopefully, or near that or after. Either way, it's going to be alright, hopefully. Right, there we go, we've done this one. So this this is Mother of the Dead done. I didn't even uh, tell you guys it was Mom of the Dead but you probably realised, I don't know. Uh, but I don't really need to point it out now because the map's been out for that long. <laughs> Unless uh, you don't play zombies or watch other YouTubers. I don't know, well I'm not really a YouTuber yet. If I'm ever going to be. I don't know. But we're just going to go through. Oh, I should have go through it now. I'm not going through there. There's no blocks or anything or any point, I don't think. I'm not sure where it takes you when you go over that way. Actually, I'm going to have to go that way. So I'm going to open this. So we've uh, done two of three for the uh, pack of punch, basically. But if we go over this way, this will take us to root. Root? No. Um, or is it root? I'm not quite sure where we are. I'm going to activate that. I haven't activated one of the teddies. But I don't really need to because I haven't got sound. I'm sure this is for it because we've got this kitchen style area. I think this is the upstairs of it. Wait, there's an upstairs of it? I've never been here. I actually haven't been here for it. Yeah, it's for it. I don't remember. I probably have, but I don't remember. Remember, sorry, um, being up here. Oh, I do re remember it being with the mystery, but I never knew it could be in this area, which is awesome. I do not remember being in it. Remember being. Oh, this is where you build the thing, yeah. I sort of remember it now. I think this area I don't rem remember, so uh, yeah. Pretty weird. Right, if we go down here, I think you have to buy this. Oh, yeah, you do. So if we buy this, we can go down, go down here, and uh, possibly activate this. I don't know. And uh, right, two or three, two or four. Uh -huh. We can do this. I don't know. Uh, round seven. I'm doing wood. Uh, how many zombies? Right, one. Yeah, no, two. No three, no four, okay. There's gonna be a lot of zombies still, so let's see, uh, kill them. And uh, hope for the best. Right, um, I'm gonna kill two. Is any more than two? Yes, there is, right, kill that one. Any more than two? No? I don't think so, hopefully. Right, we're going to keep two of them and then activate this. Hopefully I won't go down. Right, we've got insta-kill for a moment, so let's try and use this to our advantage. To our advantage. Right, you're not going to down me, are you? You're not going to down me, hopefully. Come on, hurry up. Right, there we go, done. Wait a minute. Yeah, that's alright. Thought that was going to change around then. Um, and uh, that's three or four now. So if we go over this way, we can possibly. So we're coming up to 50 minutes now, but I'm hopefully gonna. No, I'm going to get near to it, so I'm keen now. This doesn't work. I wish they had a working teleporter, but if we can go up here. I haven't played this much, to be honest, because the mud tools come out near this time, I think like this was off one day of release and I think I played it once before playing it, all the mud tools which may be the other way around uh, if we go through I don't think, no I'm not going the right way but uh, it is isn't dies and drag, I don't know why they mastered that but that's through the last one but for now I'm going to end the video here so we'll probably need the uh, 15 minutes mark so i hope you guys enjoyed this video 
and uh, leave a like rating subscribe and do what you do and uh, hope you guys enjoy this video until next time goodbye